you don't know how to drop off properly, so you have to use the gross exaggeration to describe your drop offs to your friends. And now you have to ride with a spare pair of underpants because drops are your kryptonite. Dave here from A2B Biking and here are 6 tips that could fix your drop offs in less than 60 seconds. Let's go! First up are the critical skills. Learning to lift that front wheel and unweight the bike as you leave the lift is essential. Notice the suspension uncompressing and unweighting as I leave the takeoff. Next up, what's happening before and what's happening after. You need to know beforehand whether you need to be pedaling for extra speed or potentially even braking to slow down before or after the drop. The technique for a small drop is the same as it is for a large drop. Progress and build up slowly, find yourself a small drop you can repeat a bunch of times to lock in your technique. Fourth, you need to know what's on the other side of a drop off to avoid dropping your front wheel and risk going over the bars. It pays to push your bike over the edge to know whether you can roll off an obstacle or if you need to use your drop off technique. Don't be doing any braking on the lip, it'll mess up your body position and throw you into a forward rotation as your front wheel leaves the lip, leaving you going over the bars because